everyone, this is Mom from Sparkly Belly. Have you had a belly dance costume that just doesn't give you enough coverage? Maybe you want a bit more support or maybe you want a bit more modest look. This video was inspired by an article called Costuming for a Well-Endowed Belly Dancer over at bellydanceatanysize.com. I'm going to include a link to the article in the description box so you can check it out. I thought this topic of adding more coverage to your belly dance costume bra applies to dancers of all sizes because it's about feeling confident and comfortable in your costume bra. So in this video, you're going to see four different ways of adding more coverage to the tops of your bra cups that will make you feel more secure and comfortable in your costume. Method 1. Add strips of matching fabric or beaded trim. This is a method suggested by the author of the article, Oriana. Basically take a matching fabric or if your costume comes with a headband or armbands that you don't use, take those apart and add strips of that to the tops of your bra cups. I like to use a strip of interfacing as a base to make it a bit sturdier. Then cover it with fabric and you can decorate it to make it seamless. Method 2. Add ruffles. I love ruffles. This is a method I tried recently and I really like the look. If you're not sure how to make ruffles, check out my video on how to make ruffles here. Place the ruffles along the top of the cups and hand stitch the strip. Method 3. If you can't find matching fabric, Use different type of fabric that complements the costume and add it to other places so everything has a balanced look. This is basically the same technique as methods 1 and 2, but I often encounter times when I just cannot find matching or even same type of fabric. So in this case, I take different type of fabric that may work with the costume and add pieces tastefully to different parts of the costume to give it a balanced look. For example, for this red bedla, I decided I want to add ruffles, but I did not want to add any more solid red color. So because I had this red and white chiffon, I took this fabric and created a strip of ruffles. After adding the ruffles to the top of one cup, I just cut small pieces and hand stitched them onto the other cup. And I also added a ruffle sleeve type of decoration here, which I will show you how to make in the next video. I also added ruffles to the belt too, so this fabric doesn't look like a stranger in this bedla. Method 4. Make a strap that connects a cup and a shoulder strap. If your bra cups are a bit too big on you, sometimes there's that gap between your chest and the bra cups that make you feel uncomfortable, especially when bending down. You can improve this by making straps with matching fabric. Pin one end to the center top of the cup at an angle. Then try on your bra and take the strap diagonally till it meets the shoulder strap. You should feel that this gives extra tension and closes the gap. Pin the end and just hand stitch to secure the ends. Straps are fun to play with on your costume. You can run the straps other ways or make a thick strap running across your chest to give more coverage and feel free to decorate the straps. Hope these methods will make you feel more comfortable in your belly dance bra. In the next video, I will show you how to tackle the extra flesh that shows up on the size of your shoulder straps and cups. So stay tuned, share this video with your troop mates, and thanks for watching.